Hi everyone. So I just recently purchased the high-end fed three-band mini antenna. Uh, this is from the high-end company in the Netherlands. Uh, this arrived about almost a week after I uh, purchased it. And the uh, high-end fed three-band uh, mini antenna is for 40, 20, and 10, where 40 meters, it's going to be one, uh, the SWR is going to be from 1 to 2, uh, 20 meters is going to be 1 to 1.8, and 10 meters is going to be about 1 to 1.8. Um, the, um, the antenna is half wave for 20 meters and a full wave for 10 meters, while on 40 meters, it's electrical half wave. Um, why is it electrical half wave? I'll tell you in a minute. First, let's look at the transformer here. Really nice. Um, very lightweight, but hefty. Um, you have BNC connection. Um, I mean, this is more for portability. Uh, you think of uh, things like the IC705 or something. Um, but it is 100 watts, 100 watt load PEP, uh, which is pretty impressive for a small little device. You have uh, some strain release or relief here. And then you open this up so you can connect the banana plug, the wire that comes with it. It's really nice. And the size, you can see that uh, it's almost the uh, height of a uh, pocket knife. And if you compare it to, let's say, to a, a Baofeng, uh, the, GT, the new GT5R, right? It's uh, smaller, the transformer. Look at that. Crazy, isn't it? So, and well, it's almost approximately the same weight. Probably the radio is a little bit heavier. Okay, then what do you get? You get these ties. That's really nice. Okay. You get this bag, which is really nice too. You can put all your items in there. And then you get your, your wire. You have the jack over here for the banana plug. See that? Right. You uh, connect that here, and uh, you can screw this on very easily. That's nice and tight. Then you have this other piece here, right, where you can um, alleviate the strain. hope so. There we go. Okay. Now, if you tug this, you're really tugging this piece here, and there's no strain on the connection here. Very nice. Well, well built. The wire is, wire's really stiff, um, but still flexible. And um, I'm not sure if you pinch this, what would happen. I don't want to do that. And I got to read. Um, most likely, you can't pinch this or else something might happen to it. I'm not sure yet. I like these ties. These are really nice um, to put this together. And you can see how this is put together. It's like two separate pieces. This one and the one for the coil. Now the coil here is well done. Really nice. Um, doesn't seem like that's gonna come off anytime soon. And then you have the insulator, uh, which is really um, nice. Put your paracord here, tie it to a tree or something. Then it has this middle hole where you can um, slide your uh, mast to hold it. 
Uh, really nice. Uh, I do have a wire, um, uh, something to wrap the wire in from, uh, um, this one is, it says Invento HQ, uh, but I got this one from um, Soda Beams from the UK, but I'm sure this will, this will be fine to wrap it around. Um, so, I bought some other things too. Oh, by the way, if you're liking this content, <laughs> please subscribe. Um, and please give it a thumbs up. Thanks. All right. So, a few accessories that I purchased. We'll talk about that. But this is the 20... This is the 20 meter um, wire. Now, the 20 meter wire uh, will be a half wave for 40 meters. Okay. This one right here, this one, because of the coil, this line is much smaller. Um, probably less than 41 feet, while this is 60 feet. One big difference between a coil and no coil uh, is, of course, the length, but apparently you gain about 6 dB more on the um, 40 meter band. Now, 60, if you, you're gaining 6 dB, that's approximately um, one S unit, which might be just enough for you to go above the noise level when you're doing QRP. Um, not only that, if you're using QRP, it's possible um, you can stay away from maybe having an amplifier. And that's one of the things about QRP is that sometimes you're right there at the noise level and some people can't hear you. Um, if, if you're in 40 meters, this might be the key to give you that little push that you need. I, theoretically, that sounds pretty logical. But is it the case? I don't know. Another thing about this ring, you know, it, it looks like it's everything's kept in a circle here. Uh, so I'm going to ask if I can use one of these before anybody uses one. Um, because it looks like it's... And that's because of the line being a bit... Um, a bit stiff, but still flexible. And then I, I got some more... Um, some more of these clamps. Um, these insulators, I really like them. They're really nice. These uh, clamps here. Got some extra ones because if you unscrew this, this little bolt, this whole, if it falls in the grass, you might lose it. And then a carabiner. Uh, they have these as well. And this is like U-bolt. Might be useful for something, like maybe for a line. And that's something that um, they also recommend here. Um, if you if you cut three centimeters, so you have to unscrew this and then unfold this. If you cut three centimeters, which is approximately one inch, check Google, <laughs> make sure it is. But it's about it's it's probably a little more than an inch, but. If, if you do do that to go from 7 to 7, 1, it does. So don't cut like, you know, I think that's about an inch. Boom, cut that. Uh, you might pass the point of no return. Um, and how do I know that? Because I got its big brother, not the mini, but the, the other version. And I did cut it a little bit, and wow, made a big difference. Also, some people say, well, don't cut it, you know. Just, um, just fold it, you know, just uh, unscrew this, push, you know, pull this a little bit more and then screw it back. That probably does the same thing. Um, but again, you know, um, watch some videos, um, get to know your, your, your product. But this is what you get. Well, this is what you get for the um, multiband mini. 
uh, really lightweight. I can't wait to try it on the field. Um, I like its big brother. All right, so if this was um, informative, please give it a thumbs up. Please consider subscribing, and I hope you I hope you have a great day. This is Frank Whiskey Charlie Zero Oscar.